if participants leave the course seeing and thinking about the world the same way as they went into the course, I would consider that we had failed in our duty to them. <laughs> there are certain things afterwards that one just can't see the same. I guess I have to say I'm slightly concerned um, about the impact this might have on people because um, there's this famous quote about Tolkien saying that he couldn't say the things he was going to say after becoming acquainted with Barfield's work. Um, yeah, colors hopefully will not be the same afterwards. The human skeleton will not be the same afterwards. Essentially, those are just two examples, but kind of every little thing you look at, I mean, the structure of matter, the, the nature of the universe, I mean, where does it end, I guess, once you start going there? Yeah, exactly. So it's 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 the int it's it's an introduction to a much larger project uh, that we could call holistic science, that we could call a whole bunch of stuff. Um yeah. that um is a way of life. It's not a it's not a subject in the modern sense of that term. It sounds like it's not just uh, a bunch of new ideas or a different way of looking at the world. It's a different world. Yeah, exactly, exactly. Marx Marx famously said, you know, uh, philosophers have interpreted the world in in uh, in different ways, but what counts is to change it. <laughs> and we are doing that, but not in a sense that Marx thought. Um, Marx thought that we had to go out and, you know, ca ca cause a revolution. But I'm saying Barfield thinks that the revolution needs to start in ourselves. We shape how we see the world. And that isn't something that's fixed. That's something that that we can we can consciously change um, and and that also changes and that has changed over time through different cultural innovations and so in a way this course ties together a kind of a medley of different thinkers around this theme of the evolution of consciousness and I guess I mean central to these the thinkers is 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 the is a switch from a reductionistic way of thinking to a holistic way of thinking you could say and so if we want to move away from a reductionistic way of thinking what would our theory of evolution look like um so that's the kind of question that we'll be exploring uh over these six weeks the intention is to bring about a kind of a, a revolution in ourselves that then um changes the world <laughs>